nuts. All right, guys, so typical plank position. What we're going to be doing this time is having a few or, uh, just wide legs. And what we're going to do is just opposite hand, opposite leg, raising that nice and gently, nice and controlled. It's okay if there's a little bit of shaking, that's completely natural. How does everybody? Including me. But if that's a little bit too difficult to start off, guys, and you find you're following a little bit too much, the next variation you can do is on your hands and knees. I'm going to get into what's called a box position. That's the knees directly under the hips, the hands directly under the shoulders, and we repeat the same exercise, squeezing in those glutes, and into those super glutes. And next exercise, guys, we've got the squat. Yes. And um, I've got some lap ups. <laughs> uh, we've got the squat, guys. We're going to do our Pilates days. Um, so Luke's going to sit, lie down, interlace those fingers, rest that forehead on those hands. This is a hyperextension move. So Luke's just going to slowly lift that chest up. And then lift those feet up. Lovely. Emphasis on keeping this one control, guys. There's no snapping up on the way up. I don't want to see any of like this jerky motion that can really damage your back. It can pull some muscles anywhere that's going to be tight. It's not going to be very good. So nice, slow, and controlled. You're going to get to the top. You're really going to squeeze it for about two seconds. And you're going to bring it back down. Another one, guys. If you're struggling, you see how high it goes? Lovely. If you're struggling getting in that height, you can go whatever range of motion suits you. So even if that's chest only two inches off that floor or one inch, whatever. And a key thing to note here is when Luke lifts those legs, he doesn't want to be bending at those knees. See? He wants to be lifting from those hips. So straighten those legs, lift those quads up from those hips, squeezing that touch. Um, but again, guys, you can always also do repetitions. If it's too much, take them down a little bit. If they're too little, take them up a little bit. You want to match this program to your difficulty or to your. Um, Fitness level. <laughs> and thanks for the text for this workout. We'll be your final chance to hit the next 100, next 10, next 20, whatever next big digit of that special uh, special exercise throughout the workout, which is the Australian row. So the remainder of those reps, you finish them out. Awesome. <laughs> Guys, thank you very much for watching. We really hope you enjoyed the workout. If you have any questions or any requests for more workouts, leave them down in the comments. Also, let us know how you got on with it. If there was anything that was too difficult, if something wasn't explained properly, or if anything was a little bit too confusing for you, then we'll let you know and we'll fill you in either in the comments or anywhere else you'd like. So, have a great day, guys. Stay fit, stay, stay happy, happy, stay healthy.